All right. This is the last one. I can't believe Marshall's brilliant plan was to blow up the nail. <laughs> and she thought I wasn't ready. Josh, aka the Biscuit Eater, and welcome all to another episode of my long form let's play of Control by Remedy Games. Uh, we're just ending up the night here. Uh, apparently, I had a little bit more time to go, so we're gonna go ahead and do another slightly, probably slightly shorter episode. But let's go ahead and get into the thick of things. We gotta decide do we want to continue on with the main DLC we're working on, or do I want to go back up to the TV? I think I am gonna go back to the TV later because I want to finish up the, the, the this current. DLC, and then we'll come back to that. So, do that. Let's go ahead and go to missions. Go to the nail. Okay. We have found footage now, so we can always go back to it. Search and records. What is the new thing? Field research on astral entity, astral mimic. Astral mimics are physically indistinguishable from astral copies, but considerably more dangerous due to the fact that they possess very utilitarian abilities. Most notable ability witnesses levitation. It is unknown how this astral entity gained its paranatural abilities. The relevant objects of power are currently bound to Dr. Faden, which indicates the objects are not responsible. However, objects of power are intrinsically linked to the board and the astral plane. A similar link between the objects and the mimics could also exist. Or perhaps the board is able to dis dispense these abilities at their leisure with no trial in the astral plane required. The prevailing theory, however, is that the entities are simply replicating observed abilities performed by the Hiss, or even the Director herself, thanks to a prolonged exposure to our world caused by the Astral Bleed. Refer to file redacted for full report. Interesting. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and... Yeah, we're going to go ahead and continue. I was wrong, this has nothing to do with the Alan Wake DLC. I just thought it was because it had the, the light element. Okay. Uh, then you know what? We'll, we'll go ahead. We'll go ahead and do it. We'll go ahead and do it. This time we'll be smarter. And just... I just didn't want to get overwhelmed. That was my big fear. Was that I was going to be overwhelmed. I'm just going to stun him, stun him and walk right by him. Yes, no explosion gun. Let's actually change that. Let's go with uh, shatter. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I need to do that. They are so powerful. That is the problem. I wasn't going to be able to easily defeat them anyways. Thank you. 
Oh. It's red light, green light, and I don't like playing it. Somewhere close. You get anywhere close? Nowhere close. Egg nabbit. Closer at least. Damn it. Okay. me guys. Okay, well. Follow me. Follow me. Yes, I know there's lore there. I'm not going after it. Okay, this is creepy! I 
can't look for a cat statue. Of the the teddy bear? There's a teddy bear. Oh, well, I might be able to take him pick him off here. Didn't see it apparently. Yeah, it's a teddy bear. Just a random teddy bear. Yep, can't interact with it. Very hard to see here. Oh, there's the flying guys. Okay. Oh, got it. Got it. Okay. Hug it. I'm hurting in the sand. Here. Come, come follow me. Follow me. Come on down. Come on down. Ow. Ow. Not good for my blood pressure. <laughs> yeah, Ashi. Thank you so much for the musical interlude. Actually, thank you for your help in keeping these things from killing me. Because they's powerful. <laughs> T 
Continue to breathe, Josh. Don't clench so much. <laughs> There's the way out. Up there. Back at the cell. <sighs> Thank God. I don't like that music. Does that give me a collectible? Case files. <clears throat> VHS cassette tape. Item has proven impossible to fully contain when in proximity to human beings. Item is to be sent to Redacted and the Redacted of the Oldest House in order to prevent any future access. Yeah, I beat the scary darkness. Hey! A VHS home, a video home system tape cassette. Item will not eject from the television player used at the time and its altered status its altered status became evident. The VHS plays, plays footage of redacted entity A-001 in the A floor and dancing. This footage renders inv individuals incapable of movement, speech, or thought while the television screen is within view. This effect is estimated to last indefinitely, though the most time spent in the state by a test subject is 21 hours. Individuals only recollect hearing strange music during their entranced state. Footage plays on a constant loop even when the television is not connected to a power source. Even when the television and its footage are contained within an enclosed cell with no window, agents in proximity have been driven to open and enter the cell by the item's entrancing nature. Nice. Okay. So, work complete. Back to the nail. Yeah, that was freaky darkness. Freaky, freaky darkness. I don't like the freaky darkness. Stop the freaky darkness. Thank you very much. Yeah, it was fun, yeah. Just annoying. Okay, so... Okay, that's not where I want to go. I want to go back south. To the research thing. And we'll save just in case. Casting magic missile of the darkness, yes. See, level eight. Much more reasonable. I like it when the creatures in the dark are more are of a more reasonable level. Thank you very much. Anything I can do here now that I have additional powers? Okay, just like that. At least there wasn't a Gru in there. I don't know, those, uh... The, uh, the Astral Spikes, I think those definitely count as Gru's.
It defies gravity. Okay, there you go. Hello. I'm glad. I I, I I I was hoping someone would notice. You can never fully take the musical theater kit out of yourself, you know. Complete the ritual in the deep cavern. But where is the deep cavern? Marshall blew up the nail? What the hell was she thinking? Okay, again, we're not getting all we're not getting all the all the details here. So let's go see what Marshall's trying to tell us. Foundation is overrun. I was out of time and out of options. I took all the C4 I could get my hands on and strapped it to the nail. Boom. A desperate move. But it's better off in pieces than in enemy hands. What if the foundation reality? Thrilled. He always said how vital the nail was. How it was the Bureau's duty to protect it. Bullshit. Those years spent in the director's chair warped his priorities. In the end, he valued order over people, the advice of invisible voices over that of old friends. He lost sight of who he was. The board made sure of that. But I did my duty. The hiss can't corrupt a pile of smoking rubble. My last act as head of operations I'm done. At least I could take those bastards down with me. Hmm. Real quick, wanna... I'll clear some things out here. Anything that's free or less, we're just gonna... Out. Okay. All right, no. Anyway, 
on. Here earlier, and I oh no, this is this is not the same place, this is a different place. Hey, look. indiscriminate hugging of astral spikes. Not on my watch. <sighs> oh, what's up there? Famous last words, of course. find out if I can. Crossroad. Oh, that's not where I want to go. Okay, so that is someplace else, but it's not where we want to go. But that, that does mean I want to check out this part right here. Hidden location. Okay. That's the second one of these I've seen. Are they important at all? I 
kill third. Interesting. This is the director. I need a ranger at this location immediately. Oh, great. It's an honor, director. Not sure how you got here, but okay. This, that means this is going to be a, a nasty fight. Now we got 10 minutes. Sure, why not? Too much, too much, too much. given up and apparently I didn't oh well I thought I went into the void but then no I was on dry ground and then I died hello voidness my old friend Director Faden here. I need a ranger dispatched to my position. Who's gonna magically teleport? We're in this together. Great, wonderful, beautiful. Okay. Hitting me there. 
didn't realize there was that guy there. Okay. Now, the question goes now, which way was I supposed to head? Which did I, where did I come from? Where do I go? I think I came in from this side. It was on that side, so yeah, it's going to be this part here. Yeah, I don't know how he survived, but good on you, buddy. Booty balls. <laughs> it must be this way. Okay. He may have deserved a raise, but then he just kind of went without me. All right. This is the last one. Marshall's brilliant plan was to blow up the nail. <laughs> and she thought I wasn't ready. No, that's not going to work. So, nope, oh, wrong button. Let's try that again. Back on shatter. <laughs> there. Easy as pie. Fuck. But that's the last one. I, I fixed it, didn't I? Nail. Leave. Him. Here. 
chimney. Chris. Fly over where? There's nowhere to fly over to. All the way over there? There's no way I can make it. It's way too far. No, there's no way I can make it. broken things again. I've broken things again. Oh, we've got new, uh, collectibles. Astral Entity. Apology slash how embarrassing. Astral fellows slash shades are acting hostile slash very rude. We cannot direct behavior. An external slash not astral region. Comma slash fingers crossed. Next fight is probably going to be pretty tough. Well, you know what? Next fight is probably going to have to be later. Because we're at 40 minutes. <laughs> So, as soon as I can find a place to save, I will. But it's already 10.15, so... Oh, I need to go the other direction. Hopefully there will be a save point at the cave lead. Nothing else like a guy here will take me back to it. track of direction. I will end this episode as soon as I find myself a place to save. Hopefully that'll be right here, or no. Oh, there's nowhere here to save either. I mean, to the point I almost want to just jump down to... I need to get back to the crossroads. I 
think that's the exit to the crossroads. I hope that's the exit to the crossroads. And I hope there's not a fight at the crossroads. Oh wow, I'm getting some serious frame rate loss here, sorry. That was a serious FPS drop. Yep, there we go, nails complete. Hopefully showing up here won't trigger final fight. Eh, we'll talk to Emily before we go though. Or will we? What did you do? What is causing these tremors? I thought you could tell me. I completed the four rituals just like the board told me to. The astral bleed should have stopped. Look, it has stopped. The nail is repaired. But we have a new problem. My analysis of the nail indicates that it is literally a piece of the astral plane. Or possibly a vessel containing the astral plane. Or both. Either way, right now both dimensions are vibrating at completely incompatible frequencies. The spatial friction they are generating is incalculable. It's going to destroy both planes. I messed this all up. Maybe Marshall was right to destroy the nail. I should have left it in pieces. No, then the astral plane would still be leaking in. Sometimes there's no right answer, Jesse. We need more information. No. I need to fix this. Now. I'll just... I'll figure something out. No, we should really make a plan. The tremors are originating from directly below us, but we don't know what... Perfect. I'll head down and take care of whatever's going on. Just do what you can from here. Jesse, you can't just... I have to, Emily. I'm the director. This is on me. Listen to her. Okay. Alright. There we go. Saving. Got new ability. Go ahead and give ourselves a little more energy. Leaves us with five points. We'll add some more levitation. energy there we go okay so with that we're gonna go ahead and end the youtube recording all right folks with that we're gonna go ahead and close out this particular youtube video thank you very much for joining with me today i hope that you had as much fun watching this video as i had in creating it that said if you do enjoy what i'm doing here please make sure that you help me out with the youtube algorithm you know what to do like comment and if you haven't already subscribe also make sure that you click that notification bell that way you get notifications whenever new videos go live on the channel you are also welcome to follow me on all my various social channels. You can find me online on Twitter as at BiscuitEaterYT, on Facebook as The Biscuit Eater, and of course, I do stream all my videos live every Monday and Wednesday from 7.30 p.m. until 10 p.m. Pacific Time on Twitch.tv forward slash BiscuitEater. Hope to see you there. Lastly, since you stuck around this long, you're going to see some videos popping up here. You should see over here the last video that I uploaded to the channel, and over here you'll see a video that YouTube thinks you're going to really like, so check them out. Finally, of course, I do appreciate you all being here and want to thank you for joining me, but until I see you next time, come on, lovelies.